Okay. I think we might be up. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Now, before I start, um, if you're wondering what that me saying are we up on that is, I am actually uh, recording some webcam footage. Uh, if you can see me, yay. If there is no screen at the probably the uh, it'll probably be bottom left. Then uh, it just means that uh, the footage was um, well awful. But if y if you can see me, then ah uh, oh yeah. So um, today I'm going to be uh, showing off uh, what I've been doing in Bucket over the last couple of days. Um, I'm using my old uh, map from uh, when I developed the uh, Lone Creeper plugin, just because well I don't really have any others, but. Uh, You'll notice I've got this stick with an enchantment on. Now I bet you're wondering, well, what 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 on earth is that? Uh, and uh, I will show you. Now it uh, is based off of Harry Potter, and it basically gives you um, a wand. Now the knockback one is what gives it the glow, and I, I yeah, it's fair. You can like knock people back with it, but blackthorn, unicorn hair, and eight and a quarter inches all refer to stuff that. Uh, is in Harry Potter, and so uh, Blackthorn is uh, sort of like a type of wood that's used. Unicorn hair is the core, and eight and a quarter inches is the length. Woo, bit of lag here. My PC is being a bit of a douche at the moment, so we'll see. Uh, I didn't mean to hit E again, did I? No, I didn't. If you right click with the wand, you'll get a list of spells. Now currently, I haven't decided what spells that there's going to be yet, so it's just test spells 1 and up. Now the first 5 will be sort of like default unlocked, and the 6th one is a locked spell. And so for the unlocked ones you'll be able to see the name description, so like what they do and the fact that you've unlocked them. But the locked one is like that. Now I don't know how that's rendering because well I'm only getting like 16 frames a second but if you uh, remember in the credits to Minecraft when it's that weird story there's certain bits which are unreadable and it's basically the equi equivalent of that. I just put the tag in and so um, yeah if it's locked you can't see the description and the name is obscured. The name is actually exactly the same as the actual name of the thing so that is test spell 6 and you can probably count that out and so uh, yeah you'll probably sort of like see that and uh, currently uh, oh I haven't put any left and right click handling in yet so it's, it's just it's checking to see if you've got a wand in your hand so let me just uh, get sword so if you um, have a sword in your hand then it, it doesn't actually do anything but uh, if you if it's got the name wand then it will basically show this uh, left click is going to no right click is going to open this and left click is basically going to be fire them but I haven't got round to doing that yet but uh, what what I'd like really is sort of like a, a, a bit of feedback Oh yeah, it's enchanted books as well. I've got. Should I? Should I? Yeah. Should I? Should I make these the equivalent of enchanted books? Sort of like use sort of like that instead for the spell books. Four three. What? What's the? Yeah. Oops. Three four zero. Oh. So maybe maybe change the ID to four zero oh three so that they appear as uh, spell books. Um, that might be good. If if you like that, then just comment below and then I'll uh, no but what what I'd really like is um should I actually have it as physical spells from Harry Potter or should I like make my own I mean there's going to be the standard ones like shooting water out shooting fire out uh sort of like base damage ones and stuff like that but uh should I just sort of like copy Harry Potter straight off and risk being sued by them or <laughs> should I just create my own, if I am going to create my own then I will change the blackthorn unicorn hair and I won't change the length but the type, well may, maybe modify the type of wood but uh, the core will probably be uh, completely different instead of like unicorn hair and 
I think there's... I can't remember which ones there was. There was Unicorn Hair. I don't think I put Phoenix Feather in. There was um, Dragon Heart Skin and stuff like that. But I'll, if I don't, then I'll probably choose my own. But uh, yeah, any feedback, any ideas for spells, and uh, yeah. Yeah, it's been a bit awkward testing this because I needed two players and uh, I finally found out how to do it. And so uh, I uh, booted up a separate client with a uh, separate name. Ooh, my iPod has just told me I've got a Snapchat. Nice. But uh, yeah, I actually uh, logged in offline, which means uh, it wasn't authenticated by the Minecraft servers as Notch. <laughs> So I I, I I I just had to do it once, but uh oops bit of lag. But yeah. I mean if I do sort of like make a server out of this I'll create a proper map and stuff. It won't be like part of one of the standard lobby systems initial initially. Like uh well, I've been playing on the hive at the moment with uh hide and seek and uh, I've got suspicion that that's a separate server which means that it can run a plugin without uh, interfering with sort of like se separate things so if you think you join the main server which is sort of like the first lobby then when you join the arcade lobby that's switching you onto a different server and then each one of the uh, game shards almost is a separate server in itself I think that's how it runs I asked on the forums but didn't really get a definitive answer, but um, in in that case, what I'll, if I did actually create, and I'd create about six servers, maybe with about twenty slots, and it would just be sort of like wizards battle sort of thing, free for all. Maybe I don't know. Might do teams later, but uh, yeah. So I, I need to focus on the camera more because the camera's there, and my screen is actually at that angle. I have another screen there. And uh yeah, but uh hmm it's a bit weird. <laughs> Sorry. Going a bit off topic there. So if if you didn't if you don't have the webcam at the bottom that would have sounded a bit awkward. It's because I'm hoping that it'll work. But uh anyway thanks for watching guys and I will see you all later.